This is a straightforward question to read. It simply asks us to arrange the given molecules from the one containing the least polar bonds to the one containing the most polar bonds. In planning this question, you should recall that bond polarity increases as the difference in electronegativity between atoms increases. This should prompt you to pull out the periodic table and remind yourself of the periodic trend for electronegativity, which states that electronegativity increases as you move toward fluorine. With this information, you're ready to solve the problem. There is no difference in electronegativity between the atoms in S8, they're all sulfur atoms, so S8 will have the least polar bonds. To find the next least polar bonds, look for the two elements that are closest to each other on the periodic table. They will be closest in electronegativity values, and therefore have the least polar bonds. Sulfur and chlorine are right beside each other, so SCl2 is next. Then we're left with three fluorine-containing compounds, SF2, PF3, and NF3. Sulfur is closer to fluorine than nitrogen or phosphorus, so SF2 is next. And nitrogen is closer than phosphorus, so the last two will be NF3 followed by PF3. Check that you put the molecules in order from least to most polar, and that your less than greater than symbols are facing the correct way. And you're done.